So you want to make videos in Minecraft that look like this. Or like this. Or you just want to record yourself with your new villager buddies. In this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way to record yourself and your buddies in Minecraft. And along the way, it actually improves the looks of Minecraft, if you know what I mean. Shaders. There are two programs that you need to download. First is Optifine. The second is the recording software you use to record your screen and all your audio and all that juicy good stuff. The first program to download is pretty easy. Just go on your web browser, find Optifine. All this stuff is going to be linked down below. And if you encounter any issues, there is also a really good tutorial that I'm going to link down below for you guys if you have any issues. Open that bad boy up and make sure you select Optifine before pressing play. It's right there in the corner. Just uh, check Optifine. This will ensure that Minecraft starts and boots up with Optifine. Now I know what you're thinking, Optifine, isn't that for shaders? Well no, actually there's a few more features that I, even I didn't know about until a few months ago. Also make sure that you're in a creative world when you make a new world, so that way you can fly around and be the camera, not just film with the camera, but you are the camera. But there are two things that you need to know before you can become a world famous Minecraft cinematographer. Number one is learning how to use the camera mode. And number two is how to change the game mode so that you are the camera. And number three, I'll give you an extra tip. And we're gonna go over what you need to record here in just a sec. Let's start with number one. First, press the escape key and go to your settings, then options, then controls, and scroll down until you see toggle cinematic camera. Then click here and press the key that you like to assign as a hotkey for quick access to toggle this on and off. Now that you're in game and you're in the beautiful outdoors of Minecraft, Hit that key that you used as your hotkey and toggle that bad boy camera on. What you'll notice first is that it smooths out the movements that you make with your mouse and it may be too slow or too fast for your own liking, but that's okay, we can change this. You can control this sensitivity with the scroll on your mouse. So scrolling up and down will make it either really slow and really smooth or really fast and semi-smooth. So you can use this to create fast to slow movements, slow to fast movements, or uh, any combination in between. That's where your own creativity comes into play. But if you notice, you can still see your arms and inventory on the screen, and that's not very good for being the camera. We wanna be the camera, not just hold a camera. So let's fix that too. All right, director, this is step number two. You're gonna wanna hit T. That's gonna bring up a little text box down at the bottom here. Then you're gonna type backslash game mode spectator. What this is gonna do is take away your limbs. Uh, don't worry, you don't need them. Now double tap that space bar and go airborne. The world is now your movie set. But now how do you record? Let's get to that. I'd recommend downloading OBS Studio Live. This is primarily for streamers and other sorts of content creators, but you can also use this for recording stuff. And OBS is the reason I'm able to screen record my computer and put it into this video. So it's pretty simple to install. If you need more tutorials, there's a plethora of out there. I will probably link a tutorial down in my description, but all you have to do is add sources. So hit that add button, add your desktop screen that you're using. You can either make it horizontal, like this video on YouTube here, or you can make it vertical for TikTok and other places like that. And be sure to add your microphone or whatever external recording thing you're using for your audio, and you're done. And here's a bonus tip. You can actually use a sort of optical zoom within Minecraft while you're playing. And this option too is found by hitting escape, options, then controls, and it should be the very last option called zoom. Again, click here and add whatever hotkey that you want. You're gonna be using this while you're playing and walking around. You can hit that key and you can zoom out and see those zombos. The rest is up to you. Building, writing, editing, storying, stuff, or maybe you're just sharing some redstone experiments with some friends. The options are limitless. Now have fun out there guys, and be sure to like and subscribe to this video if it helped you out, share it with a friend. And if you like this video enough, um, consider subscribing. If you do, you'll you'll see a picture of a bunny uh, right now. Aww. Yeah, that's, that's a bunny. <laughs> yeah, what am I doing? But really, you'll just make me a happy guy for subscribing. So thanks so much for watching, and good luck on making the next blockbuster Minecraft film. And with that, I'm going to take off, be the camera, and make my own movie. So see ya. <laughs>